Okay. Are you ready? Yes. <laughs> so what you're going to do today is you're going to match those informal to formal mm -hmm. phrases. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna give you time to do that. Yes. Mm. Okay. So again, here we are matching uh, more informal phrases to formal phrases. Yeah, those phrases have the same meaning, they have the same message, but they have different level of formality. Okay, so I'm going to read the informal phrases and you're going to give me their formal Okay. You know, yes. equivalent expressions. Mm -hmm. So, you ready? Yeah. We have the year number one. What do you need? In former ways. Okay. Uh, please let us know your requirements. Very good. So, you have their need. Yes. That is more informal mm -hmm. vocabulary. And for a formal email. So, the word requirements is used. Okay. And then there is the word please. Right? Which is more polite. Yes. Yeah, very good. Okay. What about number two? We have here. Thanks for your email. Yes, please. Thank you for your email of 12 February. Exactly. Yes. Alright, for informal expression, we can use conversational expressions. Thanks. Rather than thank you. Thank you is more formal. Um, right? Next. Sorry, I can't make it. Which means? Means unfortunately I will not be able to attend the meeting. Very good. Yeah, so sorry that's informal, but formal, mm -hmm. we use the word instead of sorry. Um, unfortunately. Unfortunately, yeah. very good. Okay, next we have, could you? Uh, it means, I was wondering if you, uh, if you could. Very yes. good. Yes, if you notice, um, for a formal expression, it's a little bit longer. Yeah. Right. I was wondering if you could. Yes. Next is, I promise. Mm -hmm. It means, I can assure you that. Correct. to tell you that means we regret to advise you that very good yes so you have their sorry which means uh, regret regret yes. right and then tell tell means <laughs> advice correct um, mm. I see. yes right and then next we have the connectors but also and so mm. it's very easy to find because yeah. it's our uh, only answer mm. yeah. wow well, very good yeah. okay so it means P, however in addition therefore correct yes. yeah instead of using but we use the word however yeah. also in addition so is therefore correct yeah. mm. and then number 16 finally we have your see you next week which means I look forward to meeting you next week. Right. Yes. Yeah. So these are just very common and usual expressions that we use for email writing. Yeah. Okay. Yes. So you have to be careful in choosing um, the most appropriate tone mm. depending on what email you are writing. Mm. And that also based on the situation. If the situation is serious, mm. like complaining, 
then you want to use those formal set of expressions right there. Okay. So, okay. so again, it's very important to know or to be familiar with some useful expressions that we can use for you know, formal emails and for informal emails. Yes. Yes. So, do you have any questions? No questions. No questions. Okay. Yeah, I think that's all for today. Yes. So tomorrow we will be moving on to you know, writing subject line for our emails. Okay? Okay. So have a good lunch. Yes, you too. You too. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Yeah.